the nine. Shankar Distiller is recently opening a tasting room and distillery in Troy. Shankar is here to show us how to make some bourbons, joined by bartender James. You guys opened one week ago. How's it been going? One week? We just opened last Friday. It's phenomenal. We, were, uh, we had tons of people Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Uh, we're open Wednesday through Sunday going forward in the evening. Fantastic. Congratulations, by the way. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. We also have tours and tastings, too. So, oh. so bourbon, would you say bourbon is the uh, specialty? Yeah, so we make some uh, award-winning bourbons. We have, we have brought, like, two phenomenal bourbons and cocktails for you guys. Okay. Let's uh, let's start making them. James is over there already already twisting one off there. What uh, what are we starting with here? Yeah, so so let's start off with the uh, old fashioned. The old fashioned is made. If with, we have to. <laughs> uh, so please help yourself. The old fashioned is made with uh, our original 102. That's our uh, double gold winning bourbon. Okay. Uh, 102 proof and of course uh, bitters and simple sugar and orange peel. Now let me ask you about this because I'm really fascinated with how various alcohols come to be. So so whiskey is the umbrella term and bourbon is a type of whiskey. Is that right? Bourbon is uh, not all whiskey are bourbons, but bourbon is a whiskey. Okay. Uh, again, we also make bourbon and rye, we rye whiskey as well. Uh, again, we are, we're all getting our sourcing grain from Michigan. Mm. What's the aging process like? So our, our bourbon and whiskeys are about five to six years aged in uh, oak barrels. Uh, we age them here locally uh, in our distillery in Troy. Uh, and again, that, that gives you all the, all the flavors of oak and vanilla and caramel. Uh, why, why Troy? You know, a lot of people think bourbon, they think uh, Kentucky, you know, down to the south. But Michigan does have a, a heck of a whiskey scene. So, so Michigan, I didn't realize for a long time that actually Michigan is ideal to make bourbon. So we, we got great corn, we got great water, we get rye and barley for our, plus also the, the heat and cold temperature makes the bourbon come out really good actually. So you should try it out and try our cocktails. Yes, we will then. The second cocktail, James, you, you, you mix this up real quick for us. Can you take us through what's in it and how you made it? Yeah, this is called our Bonnie Vance. Uh, it's basically a Arnold Palmer, spiked with bourbon. Uh, it's lemon, simple, Darjeeling tea, uh, and it's made with our small, small batch bourbon. This is slightly tangential, but there's a movement, it seems, with wines, especially fine red wines, pinots, cabs, to age them in an oak barrel. And do you think that in some ways dilutes the experience of having a bourbon, which is that oak barrel experience? So, that so, people are looking for that kind of in wines instead of in whiskey hmm, and bourbons. That's interesting. Yeah, very good question. So, like, the, the ones what we have here are st straight bourbons, uh, but we also have what you call finished bourbons, finished in port wine and sherry cask. Uh, it does give you a little bit of a softer touch, but it gives a different flavor profile. So I think you know it's just an additional, and you can try those at our distillery as well. And just to talk about uh, our uh, um, Bon Vivant, uh, so the beauty about this is you know, you know, it's it's named after our brand ambassador, uh, Sir Vivian Richards, is a global uh, cricket player, a world class cricket player. It also has uh, tea coming from India, Darjeeling tea. Uh, as well as you know, uh, lemonade and of course you know uh, simple sugars. It, it's great when you take a thing like lemonade or in this case a lemonade in a, in a tea. The first instinct I think is vodka. Mix it with vodka. Right. But mixing it with a bourbon gives it an entirely different spin. It's a great cocktail. Yeah, it, it, it does give you additional flavors, which you would probably not see it in vodka because vodka is uh, a, a straight uh, alcohol. <laughs> straight, <laughs> straight drink. We like the bourbon better anyway around here. <laughs> um, all right, great. So tell people about the the tasting room. You guys have been open a week. Uh, where, where can people find you and uh, what events you guys got coming up? Yeah, so so we're right behind Oakland Mall. So we have uh, tours and tastings that you can book online. Uh, we have uh, we have a guided tour. As part of the tour, you get to taste multiple bourbons uh, oh, nice. and dry whiskeys. And coming to our distillery, you also get to taste a number of very unique special uh, products that you don't get outside, including special cocktails at our distillery. Uh, and again, you, know, you, can, you can also rent the distillery for events. Uh, we're already getting booked up for the holidays, so we'd love to have you guys there. So act yeah. fast. <laughs> yeah, act fast. James, good. thank you. Shankar, thank you thank very you so much. much. Thank you. Uh, we'll be back with much more after this break. We're giving away a mug. Don't go anywhere.